hi there guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for clicking on this video your support is much much appreciated hi my name is Yolanda here we talk all things low carb keto banting lifestyle and everything in between if you're new to my channel welcome if you've been been thank you for coming back so today I'm just gonna do a little rundown on how it's been for my first three days getting back on track getting back to my low carb lifestyle and then also trying to lose the extra pounds i've put on during december and then rolling over into january so i've started a little mini uh, reset with documented the first three days which i have uploaded onto my youtube channel you can go and check it out and see how many weight i've lost in the first three days so if you know nosy and you want to see what I've been doing how I've been doing it and what's my tips and what's my tricks then stay tuned so guys I have done my uh, way in early this morning I think it was around about past six this morning so just apologies for the bad lighting and you will see um, what my current weight is now 92 kgs on the dot so i have officially lost 2.7 or 2.8 kgs but i'll put the correct amount somewhere on the screen so i'm very very happy about very very chuffed about that and yes it is most water weight so we're going to keep on staying focused we're going to keep on doing what we're doing and just stick to our uh, plan eating plan so for the first three days it was okay it wasn't as difficult i stick to the basics i stick to uh, not over complicating things i just had mostly um, eggs i had my yogurt bowl i had um, i had stews with some salad etc and i had lots of vegetables as you well. on my instagram i do a lot of yogurt bowls i do mostly eggs and things like that i keep my my eating plan very very simple now there is definitely lots of options um, nowadays with with low carb and with keto which is readily available at our local stores like our checkers bigger pay desk game clicks so even hoolies as well um, you know i love my carb clever the carb clever range at hoolies specifically the granola i am in love with that and that's what i used to do mostly to do my yogurt bowls with so for me just to keep just to give you a small introduction, I would keep it very, very simple. So I wouldn't overcomplicate. I the only fats I used was my coconut oil. I didn't even do butter, no cream, nothing. So I'll just do uh, option would be just to do an omelet and do a salad, and you can do your filling. But even your fillings, keep it basic. Don't overdo it. So you can do your egg protein, and then you can do a meat protein, whether it's um, ham, whether it's bacon, mince, uh, burger patties, whichever options you want. So I would say keep it basic and just do an omelet, scramble eggs with a side salad. Then as another alternative, you can do a nice stew. So get some vegetables. I used mixed vegetables, frozen veggies. It's just easier that way. I have it. I had it in my house. I didn't have to go to the shops to go and do specific shopping. I mostly had to top up with my lettuce and the cucumber, which is normal, but everything else I just had in my freezer and I just made use of what it is. Yes, I had a little bit of carrots. There was a little bit of corn in there as well, but it's no biggie out of ketosis. I'm just trying to get back on track and trying to just eliminate all the little nasty things I've been indulging in, like bread, uh, cakes, uh, chips, uh, uh, sodas, etc., alcohol, and all of those nasty little goodies that we love to overindulge in. So, so that's the other alternative so keep it basic don't overdo it i'm gonna just reiterate this don't overdo it keep it basic and for the first two weeks i normally keep my fat very very low i keep it my i keep my protein still moderate and i do my vegetables whether it's a salad or whether it's grilled veggies i, I fill my plate quite a bit with those type of things just to keep my fiber up as well after the two weeks i will wrap it up depending on where i am with my weight and then i will start introducing more fats into my diet so i'm feeling good guys i'm feeling great i've got no complaints it is day four we're officially on day four i'm so happy um uh, i'm very happy with my progress thus far next week we will see if we can start incorporating some walking some cycling so i'm very excited about that as well 
feeling good, we're doing good, we're staying focused and not complicated. Later on, I will be preparing my first move for the day. I'm on a fasting schedule. I'm doing an 18-hour cycle. I think I can only break my fast, I think, past 11. I ate quite a bit late yesterday. I only ate, I only finished eating about past 5, so I think it's quarter past 11. Then my eating window will open and, and my fasting window will be closed and then we can start prepping and I will show you what I'm going to do this morning for my first meal. It's not necessarily breakfast. It depends on what cycle, fasting cycle I'm following. So it will be my first meal for the day and I'm going to make a nice little stir fry later for, for my second meal. So if you're nosy, let's stay tuned. Hi there guys. So we are literally clearing out the fridge. I need to go to the shops later on and just stock up on a few things i think i'm just gonna do a ham and cheese and some onion omelets and then just a side salad and a small yogurt bowl as well so that is what we're going to prepare for today so, let's get started So I wasn't really that hungry today for some reason. I just made myself a one egg omelette. I just added the smart carb Cajun seasoning. And then as you can see, I had ham and then I had the cheese. And that is what I had for today with my um, yoga bowl. So my first meal for today, one egg cheese omelette with some ham, side salad and my yogurt bowl. for the day quick and easy stir fry yes there's carrots um but that's what came with the stir fry so i'm not really hung up about the carrots um i just have some chicken and then i just use my carb smart cajun spice just to spice it a little bit of ginger and garlic a little bit of onion i added some mushrooms and this is the end result can't wait to dig in guys so Thank you again for watching the video. Your support is much, much appreciated. If you enjoyed this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Your support is, again, much, much appreciated. Love you guys for watching. Ciao.